Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Karen with Fairy Garden Bath. And today's video, we are going to be making a room spray. And once again, I have my helper here. She's going to help pour ingredients. And uh, yeah, so let's just get started. Okay, so room sprays are pretty easy. All we need are, there's four ingredients. Water, polysorbate 20, preservative, and fragrance. So first up, we are going to pour our water. And I'm doing a 720 ml batch. And we want to use distilled water. Yeah, I know, I should have opened it before. Oops. Oh, that's what we're going. I'll get a paper towel. <laughs> it's okay, it's just water. I'll get a paper towel to clean it up. Okay. Can you always make a mess in your videos? Yep. But how about like a couple, like a little bit of my voice, right, Mama? You can talk, it's fine. Okay, so we got 662 grams <laughs> of water. Can you come Distilled on? water, sure, okay, you see. All right, let's clean up my mess here. <laughs> okay, and now into the water, we are going to put our scent. Yeah, our scent, our polysorbate 80, or 20, sorry, polysorbate 20, and our fragrance. Yep. Oh, I didn't open this yet. <laughs> We're forgetting to open everything today, yeah, Mommy. Yeah, I am forgetting to open everything. Okay. It happens. So I'm going to weigh it out and you're going to pour it in, okay? Okay. So I need 14 grams of polysorbate 20. There we go. Okay, let me pour it in. Okay. And we'll need the spatula to kind of okay, scoop I it can, out. I can scoop it out. Okay. I believe. You just go like this, right? Yep. Scoop it all really good. I am. Do you need some help? No, I think I got it all up. Here, let me just yep. do a final scoop here. Make sure we got everything. Yeah. Okay. This stuff is there very sticky. It is very sticky. So you might want gloves. Okay, and then we want, we want um, our preservative, and I'm using Optifin Plus for my preservative. Uh -huh. Nice seven grams, one percent. Okay, I'll wipe it up after. Okay, and I will be pouring it in. Mm -hmm. Give me the spatula. Give me the spatula. Can you use it? Mm hmm. Okay, do you want some help? I think I got it all. Here, let's see. Mom. Okay, good job. Mm -hmm. And now we need our fragrance. Our scent. Yep. And today I'm doing a blend of bay leaf and tobacco and mahogany teakwood. And we need 36 grams. So I'm going to just do half of each. Yep. And then you pour the rest with that one. There we go. And now I will pour it in. It's like a liquid. Mm -hmm. I can pour, I can scoop it. Okay. I'll scoop it first and then you scoop it. Okay. No, that's good. Okay, now we just gotta stir. Do you wanna stir? Yeah, I can stir. Okay. Then it is gonna turn cloudy. I, um, I haven't figured out how to make a room spray, spray, spray. 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 <laughs> A room spray that doesn't turn cloudy uh -huh. but I'm using amber glasses and you can't really tell that it's cloudy if you use a clear glass then you know it'd be much more obvious but um, it doesn't turn too cloudy it's a little cloudy but that's okay it looks more cloudy on day. okay I think that's good there so we are going to put 120 mils in each bottle. There we go. And 
I will do this part because yes, it's very hard. It's a little more. I'll be difficult. putting on the lids. Yep. Give me like the Yeah, we can. No, hang on, hang on, hang on. I can't see. It's a hundred. There we go. And then I'll get the lid and take okay. it off. And you can do the other ones while I put these lids on and show them. Okay. Okay. Here, this part I don't really need gloves. Okay, you're okay. done? Yeah, I'm done. Uh, I'll still be putting it on the lid and stuff, just that I don't think I'll need gloves to do that. Okay. Right, Mama? Because it's too hard to put the lid on with gloves. <laughs> Now we take off the lid. Just pull, just pull straight up. Cause you don't wanna, there you go. We'll have to press the lid. There we go. There we go. Mm -hmm. Now it smells good in here. Mm -hmm. That's fine. Good. I'm gonna move all the lids closer to you. While I, um, you're just gonna grab all the, oh, that lid rolled away. Can you get it, Mama? Mm -hmm. No, the lid rolled away. Yep, I got it. Okay, yep. And you will have to put labels on these. Yes, I have to label them still. Uh -huh. Oh, that one oh. kind of overflowed. Oh, it was just bubbling. Yeah, it's just a little bit of bubbles. It's okay. Yeah, that happens. The bubbles will go down. Yeah, it happens a lot mm -hmm. with making room for it. Mm -hmm. If you pour it really fast, though, it happens a lot. <laughs> oh, it's so many bubbles on that one. We have one more to do. One more. One more. And then we will be printing the labels. And we will not be putting that on cam. Will we? Well, and that one didn't quite have enough, so that'll be the one we keep. That'll be. This will be our. That'll be our. And that is it. That is how you make a room spray. It's pretty easy. Mm -hmm. And you could do any size of the bottle you like. You know, you could do, if you want to use little ones, 30 mils. I like the 120 mil. I find that it's a good size and you get, uh, you know, you get quite a bit of room spray. It lasts for quite a long time. Thank you. <laughs> and that is how to make a room spray. So I hope you liked the video. If you did, please give me a like and a subscribe. And we will see you in the next one. Bye.